half or a little bit less than a year and a half old. Um, he comes to me uh, already having a little bit of obedience training already. He has a pretty good concept of most commands. However, he does not uh, hold those commands, especially if he's distracted. Um, so I'll show you what that looks like in a minute. Um, but he also has no impulse control at all. Um, if he wants to go out a door, he's going to charge out the door. If he wants to charge out the crate, he's going to charge out the crate. If he sees something off in the distance that he wants, he's going to be, if he's on a leash, he's going to be lunging and on his back two feet trying to get to it. Um, he, when he's in the crate and he sees me coming, he's barking and spinning. He's a really high energy dog. Um, when he's out of the crate, he's running around the house, he's playing with toys, he's jumping up on me, he's jumping up on the furniture, he's grabbing things off the countertops and running with them, trying to make a game out of it. Um, so he really doesn't have any manners. Um, so we're going to teach him kind of what's appropriate, what's not appropriate, um, really try to focus in on, on controlling his impulses so that we can get him reliable with his obedience around lots of different types of distractions, whether it's dogs or other animals or cars or people or food or whatever the case may be. Um, he does have a few uh, food allergies, so we do want to make sure that he only accepts food from his owner and, and never just grabs food that he sees um, laying around. So I'll show you um, what he knows right now. Caleb, sit. Caleb, sit. Good boy. Good sit. Now if I walk away from him, then he's just going to get up and follow me just like that. Um, so he's not going to hold a command. I'll show you his down. Caleb, sit. Good. Down. Kayla, down. Down. Okay, Kayla, Kayla, down. No, sit. Good. Down. Kayla, down. Come on, down. There you go. Good. Down. So it takes him a little while to actually do the command, and then, um, again, like once I walk away, he doesn't really hold it. He just kind of gets right back out of it. So, um, we're going to teach him how to be a little bit more stable with that. He's a really loving, sweet dog, um, just very innocently excited about everything. Um, but he really thrives off that love and affection and, and attention. So he's going to be really awesome to train, very uh, easy to motivate. Um, so I can't wait to show you his progress in just a couple weeks. Heel.